All right, you guys, we are back with the TikTok Lucky Scoop review. This is what everything looks like straight away when you get it from the box. And I'm gonna be opening everything for you guys in this video. I'm also gonna pull up the original screen recording that captures everything that was in the scoop. These Lucky Scoops come out of China and the company is called DH Crystal Service. Now, if you haven't heard the news, TikTok Lucky Scoops have been banned on TikTok and that is due to gambling. It is a Against their terms of service. Now, I just want to be clear. <laughs> I'm not the one who banned TikTok Lucky Scoops. TikTok banned TikTok Lucky Scoops. I'm going to put up the definition of gambling, whether you agree with it or not. TikTok does consider this gambling. So let's jump in and look at what crystals we got. So this is three scoops in total. I will put the price I paid up on the screen. And let's go ahead and watch the beginning of the Lucky Scoop that I got while I start to open these. Bobby, are you here? Yes, I would do that one for you. Okay, my friend, my dear Bobby. Okay. My friends, one. Wow, okay. So I ordered this during Christmas time, so that's why there's a lot of Christmas trees and Christmas hats, just for your reference. And my friends, two skill is here. Two. Oh, wow. Let me give you more, my friend. Let me give you more. Yes. And three scoops. This was three. So that's what three scoops looks like. It looks like there's a couple of larger pieces in there, which is exciting to see. Scoop for you, my dear. Wow, look. Purple party, my friend. Look, this all for the dream amps here. Wow, and purple mica. Purple one for you. And here, Christmas tree. And a Merry Christmas, my friends. Merry Christmas. Wow. Merry Christmas tree. And this one for the tower. Wow. A lot of patterns. So crazy. This one for the turtle bee, my friend. Turtle. Ooh, I love turtle and okay, so I just opened the first one and there is the turtle, snowflake, and mushroom. So let's keep watching while I open the second one. Another snowflake here and two, this one, two spear. And it, look, my friend, here for the mushrooms and this one, scout for you, my friends. Okay, I will give you more wishing photo and more. Let me check. Okay, so this is the second thing I opened. It's a little clear bag, I guess, that you can put stuff in. Maybe put your crystals in. It's kind of cute. Let's go ahead and open this one. I more wishing bottle and and there's two more wishing bottle for you. Okay, best of wishes for you. And here, my friend, let me give you a free gift here. One and bag. Okay, lucky bag here. Please waiting, wasting, wa please people wasting their money. Huh? Yes. Uh huh. Okay, so that was the little freebie bag. So I did get that. Here is one of the towers. This looks like a pretty nice moss agate tower, but again, has the glue dot on here. A lot of the times when you try to remove this, it'll break the tip. But overall, actually, this is a pretty decent piece. So let's go ahead and open these other ones. Okay, so that was the entirety of the video. Okay, so here's the sphere. It actually looks pretty decent. This is a dream amethyst sphere. It has some really nice color, a little bit of yellowing, which I'm assuming is iron, but honestly, not bad. It does have quite a bit of white, which is common for dream amethyst, but pretty decent. So the next thing is this little freebie box, I think. Let's see what's in here. Oh, wow. So this is what was in the little box. This is a really nice piece of rutile, a very high quality piece, very much packed full of rutile. I'm quite impressed. This is probably the most valuable thing that's been in the box. So let's open up these last two and see what else is inside. So the next two things are these little wishing bottles. I did see them put those in the order. So those are correct. Here is all the other stuff. I was wondering where this all would fit. So let's go ahead and open this up. So it's very much like a crystal confetti. There's a lapidolite, two red jasper spheres. These are all three larvakite, two larvakite moons and a larvakite skull. A little tiny um, flashy lab tumble. And it looks like a low quality Amazonite bracelet. And then the rest is just a mix of chips. It looks like some red quartz and dream amethyst chips, some agate and clear quartz, nothing overly rare, but let's open up this last package. I was wondering where the tree is, but it looks like it's right there. Okay, and there is the tree. This 
material looks like the phoenix stone which always looks a little bit dyed to me but that is the phoenix stone christmas tree decent quality and then here are all the hats they did package all these separately so how many hats one two three four five little hats for your crystals she had put one on the tip so i guess that that does work so before i end this video i'm gonna go back and review the footage and make sure we actually got everything just from first glance it does look like we got everything that means this one isn't as much of a scam as some of the other ones i've seen and heard about the one thing i'll say is the value just doesn't quite seem there for me these i know from a wholesale perspective you can get very cheap Dream Amethyst is generally pretty cheap out of China. These are like a dollar a piece. These are like $2 a piece. These are old stock from Christmas. They're relatively cheap. The mini spheres are always a couple bucks wholesale. This is honestly like five bucks maybe. You can see that they ripped the retail price off some of these. Specifically these two. They had stickers on them for pricing. My theory is some of these are abandoned boxes from sellers who didn't pay their bill and they're just trying to get rid of the inventory. I will say the one valuable thing in here is this root tile, but that's probably the only thing of value. Everything else in here is probably five bucks or less, especially these chips. I mean, you can get a bag of chips like this for 10 bucks, like a full, like full on huge, like pound of chips for 10 bucks and these i mean i mean these are like five cents or whatever so i don't think it's worth what you pay i think part of what you're paying for is to get it from china to here which usually a box like this would cost 15 dollars to ship but that's just my personal opinion and perspective based on all of the shipments and things i have ordered from china so let me look back at the footage and make sure we got everything and i'll call out anything that's missing so i just realized in the comments someone was like oh my god you buy from dh crystals i bought from you before to that person if you see this video i'm only buying from them for this video it's not like i stock my crystal shop with lucky scoops though some people do that and no hate to them if they want to buy cheap crystals and resell them in their shop a-okay i will be reselling this lucky scoop from dh crystals if you want to buy it for what i paid for it i have no need for these crystals they're not something i would put in my collection they're not my taste not my style but if someone absolutely loves this scoop by all means purchase it but yeah i just wanted to clarify for anyone who is out there i do not source my crystals from lucky scoops like there's nothing wrong with that but just to be super clear and super transparent if you watch any of my videos on youtube you'll see most of my crystals come from brazil or from madagascar like i just don't end up sourcing from here so no hate but just to be clear since that comment did show up on the screen okay you guys i rechecked the footage and we did get everything in the lucky scoop i will list this on my website only if you'd like to purchase it for the price that i paid for it and yeah thank you guys so much for watching let me know what you guys think about the whole ban on tiktok lucky scoops in the comment section down below and if you enjoyed this video make sure to give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below i probably won't be doing any more of these videos but thank you guys so much for watching make sure to like and subscribe and i'll see you on the next one